B.B. Sanders presents The Dear Stan Scholars. Good book reviews for curious minds. Okay, so just finished uh, Von Clausewitz's On War. And so I decided to read it because uh, that is the book that so many other uh, scholars, leaders, thinkers, generals uh, will, will reference as being kind of like a, the foundation for like, other scholarly works. Clausewitz dies. He was a, a, a well-accomplished uh, general in the Prussian army. Uh, it was kind of like one of their thinkers, what we would consider like the G5, like the you know, strategy dude. Um, and he wrote a lot about all these different things uh, that was on war, right? So anything from like uh, boldness to uh, like what, like operation, I uh, thinking at different operational levels and all these sort of types of things. And so uh, he, he writes these things, dies, his wife goes in and says like, look, he did all this work. I want to try to put it together in a book and uh, and publish a work almost kind of like, like you know in a memorial of them. Um, and so that's that's what happens. Uh, a couple of his uh, his buddies help her kind of arrange it, so it it gives the appearance that it is um, a well thought out kind of um, contemplative work over these things. But whenever you actually get into it, every chapter is like this snippet on this like you know this one topic. Or, or whatever you know that, that thing may be we are putting out trail cams for uh next year's hunting season that i won't be a part of because i'm pulling so like john boyd would go back and say like after he read it he said that like he found it contradictory that that clash which seemed to contradict himself at different points and uh and so i i had read boyd's biography and that he's quoted in in, in there saying that and uh I, I was looking for that as I went through there, and I can totally see where he's coming from because, like, on one hand, Clausewitz is saying, like, go do this thing, but then on the ne next hand, whenever it's in a different context, he's like, don't do this thing. So, it's a way to read. It's it's not a, an easy one. It's something that you you want to read through it probably one time as like a novel, so that way you have a kind of a broad understanding what you're of of, of what it is. But don't think it's going to be like a read to a novel or anything like that. favorite part or the favorite aspect of it is that like it's probably the first modern thought product because like the, all the other like um like uh thinkers you're gonna have like the, the greeks um I think, uh, and then like you'll have like a uh, uh musashi uh, or sun Tzu and stuff like that um you'll have those guys but then uh Clausewitz is the beginning of like kind of like the modern era military thinkers and so you get like strategy in in light of uh you know cavalry artillery and so like things that you can that, that are more easily relatable to to real like you know our uh, time period so that's probably the best the, the favorite part about it the uh, favorite attribute now the biggest takeaway for me is that he talked about um as uh one climbs and rank and rank he needs to become more uh, reflective. So like, uh, he, and this is in his chapter on boldness where he talks about the uh, the, the, the PL, the, the, the lowest level like officer and stuff. Like it almost does him no good to be, really be reflective, but just simply be like really, really aggressive. Just you know, go out there and be like, hey, like, here, here's your mission and just attack. But the higher up you go, the, the bigger your scope gets and the more the things that you have to consider. So like uh, he talks about how like uh, the general uh, needs to not really be necessarily an expert in the tactical level stuff. Like he doesn't need to know how to, to, to you know, set up a good like flank on, on like a platoon size thing. What he needs to be really, really good at is uh, being a good statesman and being able to look at like the strategic environment and understand what's going on at that level and be able to like place his uh, maneuver inside of that uh, political reality. And probably one of the most qu quoted things that Clausewitz uh, said as soon as his book opens is that, you know, war is just politics by another means. The biggest value in reading that book is the fact that if you read uh, any of the other, like, more modern military thinkers and stuff, they will always uh, reference Uncle Clausewitz. 